Methanol pool fire extinguishing tests were performed in the research project ProFlash with the objective to increase knowledge on fire protection of low flashpoint ship fuel installations. As part of a large test series, a test was performed with a methanol pool fire which was about 2.4 meters in diameter at ignition. The tray in this test had a slightly conical bottom to consider expansion of the fire pool with increased application of water during extinguishment. After three minutes pre-burn time, a steady heat release rate had been established and a water spraying fire extinguishing system was activated. The discharge rate was 5 liters per square meter in minute in accordance with prescriptive requirements for machinery spaces. In addition to a low flashpoint, methanol has oxygen bound to the molecule and emits little heat through radiation, and these characteristics make methanol difficult to extinguish. With water, spray or mist, dilution of the methanol surface layer is the primary extinguishing effect. Other tests have shown that methanol can burn with up to almost 90% water. After five minutes of activation, dilution of the extinguishing system was stopped in this test due to the risk of overfilling the tray and causing a running fire. And watch what happened. The methanol pool fire appeared to go out when the water spraying system was turned off, but this was not the case. It became clear that increased water dilution of methanol causes decreased visibility of the flames. This methanol fire hazard was previously unknown and must, just as other introduced hazards, be addressed by suitable safety measures. Foam injection to the water strongly improves the extinguishing effect, much owing to the film forming function. Find further results in the full project report at ri.se under scientific publications.